Wouldn't it be fantastic if you can just sit at home and make money? Well, I've been doing some research. I've come to the conclusion that you can actually put the hours in and actually work from home. Now I'm gonna list a few things off the top of my head that will probably help you. Go and check them out. I got nothing to do with these websites or any, I'm not getting any profit from them or anything. Now, there's a bunch of survey websites. They do take long. You can make a little bit of change on the side. You're not gonna really make an income to support your family or your livelihood um, from there unless you spend no money or you've got another source of income. They're great survey websites. If you need any, I'll be happy to uh, pull up some and if you leave a comment below, just say give me a few survey websites, I'll just list them down. Um, they work good. There's some that pay one to two dollars depending. You could probably make three to ten dollars um, a day from that. Now, although that's not fantastically massive money, um, it does help um, do it all week, you, um, do it for the month, sorry, and you can end up with, you know, $100, $100, pounds, which ain't too bad. Now, second way is if you have a skill or you're willing to do certain work that people are willing to pay you for, I mean, I pay people to do certain things I don't want to do. For example, date your input. Um, I had a massive book that I wanted copied and written out. You know, I sent it in a PDF to someone and I paid them $50. It took them a day. Um, that's not too bad, I think, especially um, the currency I was paying was different from their currency, so it worked out a lot better for them. Um, that's called freelancing, basically. Um, you can go from there. Um, freelancing, there's so many things you can do. Try Fiverr.com. That's F. I'll put the links below. Fiverr.com, Freelancer, Odesk, they're the kind of freelancing websites that you can do well with. Now, another thing that people forget is um, eBay is another thing you can actually freelance on. Now, there's a lot of people selling websites on there. There's a lot of people writing reviews on there and charging. You know, I saw someone that writes five-star reviews on Google Plus, um, Google Review, and they sold 6000 for one, one pound. So they made £6,000 just by doing that little simple work. Now that's something you can try. Um, I don't think it's totally in their terms and conditions being paid to review. But a lot of companies do it. Most companies do it. Um, and you know, that person's laughing. He made a bit of money. Probably made a few thousand um, from that. Cost him nothing. Now these are the things you might think, oh, this is, this is terrible money. I can't make it, you know, survive on this money. But it's a part-time income. And once you build up a steady stream, you'll be looking at maybe spending money to make money. You'll, you'll start a website to, you know, market off your ideas, uh, your freelancing services. Um, slow and steady. You don't, you don't ever, you know, you hear people, um, like I mentioned, that person made £6,000 from reviews. He probably tried a lot of other things and then he, you know, he's hit it a bit big. Five or gone five, you can see what people are selling. Undercut them. Um do a good service and people will always buy from you. Now, there are many other smaller ways to make money online. This is if you don't have any skills, you can do all these. I mean, if you can code, you can probably find a job straight away rather than freelance. Because um, there's a lot of need for coders, especially good coders. Um, making apps, I mean, by all means learn. And probably the best way you can actually make money online is YouTube. Um, it's a video in itself but I feel YouTube just putting out some videos like I am are great gaming videos if you like gaming put them out there um, track your progress people love to watch that I love to watch people you know starting a business or you know building something I just love it like I watched one guy who was building a house like from start to finish just like little you know it's great to watch. People love watching it and you'll be surprised. Everyone pretty much gets views on their channels. So people love to watch and you'll be surprised at the amount of people subscribe. It's easy to make money on as well. It's passive. So it's great for that. And you can also funnel the audience off, um, which is also good. Um, I don't tend to do that. I can't be bothered. It's not really worth my time. I have nothing to funnel off and I don't really want to do that. It's a bit annoying, I find it as well. But a lot of people do it, and that's where all the big money is, you know, taking the traffic, funneling it off to another website um, from all their social medias, and then blowing it up. So I hope this helped. Um, 
do do put any questions in if you need help if you are freelancing if you are doing surveys please let me know